it's not just the homeless who are at risk either when the temperatures drop. Yeah, the cold weather can also be dangerous for our senior citizens out there. CBS 42 News reporter James McConathan with us live tonight covering Birmingham. He's at Bowell Auditorium. And James, I know you've been working all day long on some precautions that can be taken. Yeah, there are some that can be taken. I spoke with the United Way today, and they've got several recommendations, but they're also checking on homebound seniors themselves. United Way took over the Meals on Wheels program in March of 2016. It falls under their Senior Services program that serves more than 1,600 people in our area with about 500 volunteers. Those volunteers check on the recipients of those meals daily no matter what the weather and try to make sure they have the resources they need when the weather gets bad. For family members of older adults and seniors, United Way has several recommendations for keeping them safe when it's cold outside. Make sure that um, they're dressed warmly, that they're prepared, um, and if they can't get to the store to try and contact someone who can help them get the supplies that they need. Um, make sure that the temperature is 65 or above in their home. Um, and this is also a great time for family to call. We recommend people touch base at least twice a day with someone who's isolated or homebound by themselves. Even better, stop by and check on them if you're in the neighborhood. United Way also has a resource for anyone interested in their services. To find out more, you can call them at 1-800-AGE-LINE. That's 1-800-243-5463. We have all that information and more on our website, WIAT.com. And for anyone who needs it, the Boutwell Auditorium warming station here behind me is open tonight from 5 p.m. until 7 a.m. That's tonight and tomorrow night. Live in Birmingham, James McConathy, CBS 42 News. Local coverage you can count on.